Yo yo, it's Gmo, and today we have a Hagobai Summer Haul. For educational purposes, all of these items in the video will be on my spreadsheet in my Instagram bio. And if you sign up to Hagobai using the link in the description, you'll get $105 that you can use towards your next haul. So for the stats of the haul, the shipping lines I took were EUB and the US Special Shoe Line. But you can also use US Express Z and it's pretty much the same thing. And both of the parcels that I shipped took 9 and 11 days to arrive from China to California. Total weight of the haul is around 5 kilograms. I paid no customs tax and I let Hagobai declare for me. But the rule of thumb should be $12 per kilogram. And as for my own stats, my build is still gamer. My height is 5'10 and my weight is 165 pounds. Alright, now that we got that over with, first up are these Eric Emanuel shorts in black. I got these in an XL and at first glance, these look very good for $4. Here's how they look on body. And since these are basketball shorts, they go above the knees. So if you don't like that fit, I suggest sizing up once or twice. The printing is very good. There's no crackling. And the tags on the inside are very accurate to retail. But you can tell that the mesh material quality is isn't as good or breathable as a typical mesh short that you might have worn before. So overall, I'm giving these an 8 out of 10. Next up, we have one of the pieces I've been most excited for. And they are the Issei Miyake Om Plisse pleated shorts for $20. And compared to retail, these are so good for the price. This is how a size medium looks on body, and I absolutely love how these fit going down to my knees. If you want them to go even lower past your knees, I suggest you size up once when you look at the size chart. But yeah, the pleating is perfect. I've already worn these out a couple times, and the fabric is so comfortable. They even have the correct tags on the inside, and if if you want a more retail look, all you have to do is remove the drawstring. But yeah, absolute cop if you like pieces like this, 10 out of 10. Moving on to some accessories, we have this Alix roller coaster belt that you've probably seen many, many times before. This listing has a ton of sales, and for $7, I mean, you can't really go wrong with this. The belt comes in this velvet drawstring pouch, and it comes with all of the tags. And the quality is honestly just crazy good for the price. The buckle mechanism works fine, it has pretty much all of the details, and yes, it does have Alix on the belt. I've seen a ton of other ones that don't even have Alix on the belt, but this one does, so it's pretty accurate to retail. So obviously, this gets a 10 out of 10, I might have to get this in a another colorway. Next up, we got this cute pleather backpack bag. I got this one in beige, but you can also get this in black. And for 10 bucks, I mean, it's a perfect little carry-on if you're a student, want something to travel with, or if you want to get this as a gift for a loved one, like a friend or a sister. The bag uses magnets to open and close the compartments, and inside there's a zipper compartment so you can store more things. And because this is a cinch bag, how it works is that you pull on these strings and then the bag will pinch closed, sort of like a drawstring bag. But yeah, for $10, this is really good. And the seller also has a ton of other bags for you to choose from as well if this one isn't your style. For $10, I mean you gotta give this a 10 out of 10. Moving on to the jewelry, we have this Vivian Westwood heart ring, and I think this is a fantasy piece because I couldn't find any retail listings, but I do like the design. For the price, I don't think this will make your skin green as this is a reputable seller that specializes in Vivian Westwood, and yeah, it's a pretty solid ring, although it doesn't come with branded packaging, so this pretty much gets an 8 out of 10. As for the next piece, you've probably seen this before on the channel, but I actually found the listing for it this time. This is a black on black VV Saturn heart necklace and here is a comparison to the one that was previously shown on the channel and has been used a ton since then. I wouldn't recommend wearing a necklace like this if you're gonna sweat but overall it's pretty clean and the build quality is better than the previous one that I showed on the channel so I'm gonna give this one a 9 out of 10. This one doesn't come with branded packaging either. Last but not least for the Vivian Westwood jewelry is this beautiful pearl choker necklace. The pearls look so nice and they don't feel plasticky at all and it definitely has some noticeable weight to it. It. And overall, it just looks so clean, but all of these pieces would be rated higher if it came with branded packaging. But the seller has its own listing for branded packaging, so you have to purchase that separately. But yeah, clean piece, 9 out of 10. But before we go on to the next item, I want you guys to comment down below what you guys want to see in the next haul. I'll take some of your guys' suggestions and I'll review them in the next haul. Alright, and our last piece of jewelry is this crazy find, and I actually found this one myself. We got this insane Among Us chain for less than $5. This is how it looks on body, and and yeah, I've gotten a ton of looks and comments wearing this in public, and honestly, I actually love it. 10 out of 10, would buy again. Next up, we got a back to school find right here. We got this Among Us backpack for only 5 bucks. I'm honestly thinking of using this from now on when I get back to my college campus, and honestly, for $5, it's pretty spacious if you're going to like two to three classes a day. There's two pockets on the outside, two side pockets, and then there's compartments and smaller pockets on the inside. So yeah, there's a lot of places to put things in. Honestly, surprisingly useful for $5. So I mean, this is Woodoey and 11 out of 10. All right, so continuing with the Among Us, we got this huge batch of tiny Among Us plushies. Each one costs 50 cents each. So as a 12 pack, this costs $6. And they even squeak when you squeeze them. 
but when I vacuum sealed these, some of these squeaking mechanisms stopped working, so be careful with that. These were actually meant to be decor for my desk, but I gave some to a couple of my friends and we accidentally attracted a dog. Oh my, oh my gosh, it's so cute. He's gonna go for it. Still a banger though, 9 out of 10. And last but not least, we got these big Among Us plushies for less than $2 each. If you're looking for some decor for your room, these are literally perfect. They're soft and thick, and even with vacuum sealing, these didn't get deformed after I unboxed them. And personally, I'd rather pay $2 for an Among Us plushie rather than those $10 ones that are smaller and don't have the colors you like. So these get a 9 out of 10. And yeah, that was the haul. Follow my Instagram and TikTok for more content. And again, if you haven't already, sign up to Hagobuy down below and get $105 free for your next hauls. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah.